Hi everyone, welcome back. Um, today I want to show you uh, what makeup and beauty items I'm bringing on my bachelorette trip this weekend. So I have everything here in this bag and I really did overpack. Um, like I can't even close this bag. So some stuff might have to like go out and go into my little suitcase. Um, but yeah, I thought maybe you guys would be interested. Um, I'm really excited for this weekend. Um, so let me show you all the makeup that I'm bringing. Um, so the first thing is the moisturizer I'm bringing. Um, getting married uh, basically right after the bachelorette weekend. Um, I'm getting married at City Hall, um, Ottawa City Hall, and then we're having like the um, wedding uh, the, the next weekend. Um, so I really like felt like okay on this trip like I'm gonna bring some good skincare because usually I would just bring like a, a bottle of oil drops or something but I'm bringing this um, it's my origins Nitamins. Um it's a very expensive moisturizer but it really works for me and I've had this one for a while now and I've been saving the last little bit basically for the the week before my wedding because I can really notice a difference in my skin when I start to use this um, one bottle of this is about $50 though, so it's not my regular moisturizer because I just, at this point in my life, like I can't be spending that much. And I go through about a tub in a month, so I really just can't be spending that every month on moisturizer. So that's the first thing. Next I have my NARS Orgasm Blush. This is my favorite and only blush, um, powder blush. Um, so yeah, I thought I would bring that. I'm wearing it right now. I like how it's kind of like shiny and it's almost like a highlighter too. Can you see? Because it's got like that gold glitter in it. I feel like today I'm not wearing concealer and you can really see like my, my dark circles. Hopefully that doesn't bother too many of you. Um, I have a brush, blush brush. I think this is, yep, it's from e.l.f. It's a very, very old brush. And I'm going to be using this for powder and blush. Um, so just kind of wipe it off on the hand. Um, I'm traveling, so I've got to be a bit more low maintenance. Um, this is an old palette from Deuce Cosmetics um, that I'm bringing. It has, it's called the Smoky Palette. And it has like these kind of colors and it's got a highlighter as well. Um, I did a video on my bachelorette party like makeup look and I used some of the shadows from this so that's why I'm bringing it and I think the other days I'm going to try to use some of the more natural colors and like I'm going to like if I'm bringing a palette I'm going to use this palette I'm going to justify the fact that I'm taking it so yeah um my eyelash curler I have lash glue from Revlon I have this silver eyeshadow for my night out makeup that's also in my bachelor party, bachelorette party makeup. I really should um, link that below. I have an eyeliner sharpener. This um, Glossier stretch concealer. It's going to be my main concealer. It's a very nice concealer my glitter this is urban decay midnight cowboy and everybody all of my friends love this glitter so i'm going to be bringing it we're going to get some good use out of this glitter for sure uh, one little blending brush um this uh drunk elephant number nine jelly cleanser this is from the sephora birthday gift it's very nice very gentle cleanser um no way i would spend what this probably costs on a cleanser but it's all right um the packaging you like turn it and squeeze out the product i don't like that <laughs> i hate when bottles have that because it just never feels sealed um I also have my Dior Lip Maximizer. I've had this for a while now and I keep saving it and I really shouldn't keep saving it because that's what happens 
Um, and then things end up getting too old and they don't work the same because I've just been saving it, saving it, saving it because it's expensive. Um, but right now this is my only lip gloss. So I've had it for about two years now. So this is a, a fun trip. So I think it's a good time to like actually use it. I love how this lip gloss looks. Um, it's so beautiful. It's in the shade 001 and it makes your lips very shiny, very big, like it's very beautiful. So I'm gonna wear that. My e.l.f. oil, which perhaps I don't need now because I, originally I was just gonna bring this oil and not bring the moisturizer. That's what I do when I do like kind of weekend trips. Um, I just take an oil and then I use that um, just because it takes up less space and I feel like my face will be fine for the weekend with just an oil. Um, but now that I'm bringing this, I actually think I might not bring the oil. So that's good. I can save a little space. But this is a very good oil, by the way. It's from e.l.f. And if you need a face oil and you're on a budget, this is $10. And it's, um, if you do the e.l.f. Uh, sales, I got it for $5 because they always have a half off sale on the website. Um, my brand new eyeliner, I just opened it today. Um, this is from L'Oreal. It's called... Um, infallible the super slim and I'm wearing it today and I really struggled because I've been without a liquid eyeliner for about two months now because um, I was saving this for my basically my wedding week um, I don't I don't know why I do some crazy stuff now that I like project pan um, so I was basically using like liquid lipstick as eyeliner and using um, eyeshadows as eyeliner for the past two months so I kind of forgot how to use liquid liner so I really struggled, but I'm gonna be taking this this weekend. Um, Tokyo Milk Dark uh, perfume, rollerball perfume. This is very, very old. I've been trying to use it up. Um, so every time I see it in my bag, I put it on, but it still smells really nice. I really wish that they still sold this at Sephora because they don't anymore. It's only on the website and it's very expensive. Um, but yeah, I love this perfume. Oh, it's in um, the scent Tainted Love. I have a brown eyeliner that I don't intend to use as eyeliner. I actually am going to use this as a lip liner. Um, it's in this sparkly brown color. That's very, very flattering. Um, I might use it as eyeliner once, um, but probably not because I've opened this one now. So I, I do intend to use this as lip liner for a dark purple lipstick. I have my eyeshadow primer. Unfortunately, these eyeshadows are not very good, so they, they do need to be used with a primer. Um, my tint, um, cheek and lip tint from Etude House. Um, I actually wear this underneath um, this blush. And then the blush stays all day. So I really do like how these look together. Um, and when I'm taking a lot of photos, I really want that blush to show because I can look a little bit washed out in photos sometimes. And we will be taking a lot of photos. <laughs> Believe me, this crowd of girls that I am going with, they're like definitely the taking photos type. Um, and I love taking photos too, so. Um, this is an e.l.f. brow pencil, and it's in the shade taupe. And it comes with a spoolie, so that's very convenient. Um, this butter bronzer. Um, this e.l.f. mascara. It's the Active Mascara and Brow Gel. Uh, because we're going to Niagara Falls, I thought I would bring this one because it's very waterproof and um, sweatproof and that kind of thing. Um, and I wore this paintballing in the rain and it stayed on. So I feel pretty comfortable wearing it if we do um, any kind of Niagara Falls water activities, which I imagine we might. So um, I'm feeling pretty good about this one. Uh, concealer brush from e.l.f. again. I'm realizing that 90% of my makeup is from e.l.f. Yep, here's the e.l.f. Um, tinted moisturizer. 
Uh, it's got SPF, so that's why I like it. I'm honestly about this much through it. Um, it does not last a long time, but it was $1.50 because it sold $3 and I got it half off, so it was only $1.50, so I really can't complain. I've been wearing this a lot, um, and I like that Like I haven't had a sunburn on my face all summer. So This SPF has been working, doesn't break me out, it's really good. Ah, of course, the star of the show, my um, new lipstick. This is MAC lipstick in Cyber. I bought it specifically for this trip, so yeah. That's like the most exciting thing, I think. Um, yeah, I actually realized my eyelashes, I do have false lashes. Um, I can't remember it. Eyelore, the brand is Eyelore, and they're in my suitcase, so they're not in this bag, unfortunately. But um, I have some prescription eye drops. If you have allergies, you need to go to an allergist. Get referred to an allergist and get these eye drops because they are amazing. They're called the Sandoz Olopatadine. Anyway, get the prescription eye drops if you have allergies. They'll change your life. And I've got like a little pocket in here. I've got some hair ties. Um, I've got this um, choker and it's got a little crystal planet on it and I just think it's the cutest thing in the world like it's so adorable I'm so into this kind of like spacey design right now and I'm also bringing these very sparkly earrings they are shaped like stars and they're really just like eye-catching and cool. So that's like the only jewelry I'm bringing, which I think is fine because my outfits are very loud, so I don't think they really need much um, jewelry anyway. So yeah, that's everything I'm bringing on my trip this weekend. I really hope it goes well. Um, yeah, um, I definitely, like I'm usually quite a minimalist. And when I travel, like the last time I traveled, I went to the UK for, God, almost two weeks. And I brought like a much smaller bag. Like I brought three samples of lipstick, um, eyeliner, mascara, eyebrow pencil, and that's it. And I was gone for two weeks and I'm going for a weekend and I'm bringing like basically all the makeup I own. But yeah, I've been really excited for this trip and um, I've been really excited for my, my makeup and outfit for a really long time now. So yeah, it's a lot, <laughs> but I think that's a, it's a good thing. So, oh, and I'm also bringing the Vichy uh, face masks that are in my previous video. So maybe I'll link that down below as well. Um, Vichy was very generous and along with Influencer, I signed up um, to review some products and they sent me their face masks. So we're, all the girls and I are gonna be trying out those face masks this weekend. So thank you. Um, please subscribe if you're not subscribed for more videos and um, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.